if a person has disordered guts, so they're not producing enough enzymes to help them break down food, eating too many raw foods can actually be really tough for their gut, especially like greens, like salads, things like that. They're very difficult to break down. They have thick cell walls and we don't have the enzyme power to do that, especially if the gut is, is not in good health and the microbiome is not there to help support that breakdown then a lot of what I, what I do with my gut patients is I actually have them eat cooked vegetables first. The more disordered they are, the more cooked the vegetable, and as they get better, we can start going into steaming and not, not being as overcooked. But you have to think of cooking as the act of digestion outside of the body. The other way, thing that you can do sometimes with raw, and you may or may not get away with it depending on how healthy the gut is, is using a high um, speed blender and breaking down the cell wall then drinking it that's a little bit easier than eating the raw vegetables themselves but if your gut is not in good order you've got to start with cooked vegetables and then slowly that would be a sign that the gut is getting better as you're able to tolerate eating salad and what would be the typical symptom if your gut is, a, is not doing well and you eat a salad, you feel like it sits in your stomach forever, you can't digest it well, you get bloated, you get uncomfortable, maybe you get abdominal pain.